Hello and welcome back to another episode of Wasteland 3. My name is Saiken and today we're continuing our blind playthrough on Supreme Jerk Difficulty, episode 19. Still only to death, uh, so we are doing quite well. Uh, better by the day, matter of fact. And we're starting with handing in uh, the uh, movies that we found. We've got the movie reels from the bunker, but they look pretty damaged. Let's see what we've got here. Damn, this looks pretty bad. Can you still use them? Where there's a will, there's a way. Just stand over there and look cute while I check this out. What's the verdict? Well, I won't lie. They aren't exactly what I was hoping for. But we can salvage this. So here's what I'm thinking. The film is falling apart. And I can't get a full show out of any of them. But I'm seeing bits and pieces that we could totally use. Let's examine the reels together, and we'll come up with a story worthy of chicks flicks. Okay. Here, look at these. Do you see a good main character? Uh, we see a man running from a boulder, two cops. Oh yeah, two cops, that's good. takes over brilliant so far apart in hairstyles but so close in passion that's a great setup but we need to decide where it takes place here look over these reels. car racing down the road wooden ship <laughs> or military flight academy um you know what cops car seen cuts inside the vehicle Turns out lots of people are crammed in there. The lightning has energized not just the car, but also their sex drives. And a spontaneous orgy erupts. Not now for the pièce de résistance, my lovelies. Some of these old reels still have semi-legible labels. Give it your best shot. Sex me up a title. Fuck loose, romancing the bone. Goat thrusters, I think fuck loose. Oh yes, baby, that's perfect. Oh, I see you have some beauties of your own with you. What do you think? Could one of your gorgeous friends star in our premiere? Wouldn't be long, I promise. How long would you need a companion? Oh, just for a hot minute, darling. <coughs> They'll be right back with you. Girl Scouts honor. It looks up Quan's alley. I must admit, Quan is the one for the sex job. So here we go. Uh, I've been a fan of your work for many years, Adelon. It would be an honor. <laughs> oh, Marshal Quan! It'll be our pleasure. A job well done, you. Okay, everyone. Places. Our audience awaits. What's that? A script? Ladies, gents. That was everything a simple man could ever dream of. Now, don't you think your 80 would forget your dues? You've been such a big help, Sugar Pies. So here's your reward. Come talk to me later to see how we got on, okay? Yep, yep. Quan is the best. <laughs> Quan is, uh, is officially the best. Good. <clears throat> Nothing like starting a, a new episode with a little bit of porn. Uh, I'm not even sure if I'm allowed to say that on YouTube without getting demonetized, but okay. Let's take a look. So, we have upgraded uh, Lucia here. Could require a little bit more strength since she's in the front line. Her speed is fine, her awareness also could be good. She's oftentimes hitting very well, but she could be even better. She only has 100 hit points, so that's not great. In terms of perks, let's maybe start with the perks first, right? So we can still give her the shotgun perks if we so wanted. I like the conductive beams, that isn't bad, if we get weird signs up high enough. How much weird signs do we need? Nine. Okay, well that's not happening, not yet. Okay, she could get more healthy, 
Could go for the shotgun perks. That's not bad. I generally like that. And hmm. So listen with strength, uh, she would get a few more hit points. Awareness would allow her to uh, get range damage bonus. That in itself is good. Uh, it's just better hit chance overall. Uh, she doesn't need luck uh, or char uh, uh, charisma, uh, rather, sorry, because we are effectively uh, using trickshot quite a bit. But I think I might, besides her normal weapon, I might give her a shotgun because shotguns are very, very good. And if she's anyways in the front line, there is a lot that she could uh, do with it, right? So she got six skill points. Uh, we can upgrade weird signs if needed. Um, and then we can upgrade it again the next time. So that's good. Getting almost all the way there. And now is the question, do we want to go and be healthy? More damage with shotguns versus cover. This one here, Devastation, is good. I like that. Uh, strike meter with any handgun attack. Well, that's not shotguns. This here would just require a small arms. And it's a handgun, so handgun, handgun. This here would uh, work for both handguns and shotguns, right? Right. Hmm, 10 survival isn't bad. Uh, I suppose it's really not that bad. Good. We already got microwave research, energy damage increased for every point of armor the enemy has. I'm definitely not going to go into overcharge. So really, point, uh, point being, I think we're, we do have time for a couple of shotgun perks, right? Um, extra quick slot, sure, uh, that's not bad. Extra con is not bad either, but I think we're just going with um, a few more shotgun perks and we'll expand the character into using that. Um, strengths would allow her to work very well at the front line and just get more hit points. Speed isn't bad, specifically the evasion comes in handy. But I think we're going for awareness 4. Yeah, I think we're going for awareness 4 and then also strength 4. Let's just give her a bit more uh, hit points. That gives her 5. Confirm. I think the hit points are coming in retroactively as well. Con per level and con overall 15. Okay, so con per level 3. Okay, well, I, I'm pretty sure they all add up even retroactively. Yeah, we haven't gotten more con yet, but here would be a breakpoint, con per level plus six, that would be good. And then this would be the next breakpoint, uh, con per level plus nine. I think that's what we should aim for. That'll give her enough uh, hit points. On the contrary, um, inappropriate Murphy needs more AP. And I want to get two sniper rifles, nine. Sneaky shit. Uh, detection time, doesn't matter. Alarms and traps, 66% chance to malfunction for you or any squad member. Well, 
that would be good. Sniper rifles, fantastic. What else? Crit resistance <coughs> ain't bad. Extra quick slot uh, is always good. Bit of health is good. But I think I want to go for chain ambush. Sneak attack damage 100%. That would be awesome. So essentially we want to get uh, sneak up to 10 and we want to get sniper rifles up to 10 because both allow you to gain just phenomenal perks okay we're just going to wait uh, with it for now okay so since we're anyways here we just uh, cleared uh, that uh, quest a very hostile takeover would be the next one and I'm wondering if we can just uh, backstep that uh, good friend there and let Vlad continue to run uh, the show here. Would be a bad idea, would it? All right, Hogbite leads. I think these guys would want to meet us here. Okay, let's see. <clears throat> Hmm, haven't found them. Where, do, where did they want to meet? Uh, Goons asks us to meet them in their hideout, an old car dealership north of the bazaar near the collapsed parking lot. Never mind. Okay, well. Let me drive there, because that is definitely not here on the bazaar. Alright, we're in the outskirts. The description says, meters near the collapsed parking lot. So all we gotta do is find that collapsed parking lot to the north. Hmm. All right, north is up here. Listen, it says said near. The cartel goons asked us to meet them in their hideout, an old car dealership north of the bazaar near Collab parking garage. Well, north doesn't really mean a lot. Could be here for all I know. Good, we healed ourselves. Move up, and we're just trying to go north, 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 and that potentially will get us to that car dealership. So let's see if this is correct. Yeah, 
It is not. We're running into an ambush, of course. Well, fabulous. A Dorsey ambush, okay. Well, that guy already died. Kodiak moves into the very middle. And we got a big fat robot here, which I do not like. It's called a warbot. Hogbite moves in. <laughs> Hawk bite. Behave, please. That was a pretty gnarly hit. Good. Hawk bite moves all the way over here. Could be flanked, but doesn't really matter. We're moving in with Lucia. She hits the enemy sniper right into their arm. I don't want to pos position ourselves here, that would be suicidal. Murphy finishes that hunter. Nice. And whilst we're at it... Marks that Dorsey. Okay, cool. One misses a ninety five percent shot. Double hit, I like that. Whoa, I like it. Good, central. Sets up an ambush. Lucia moves further back and will he help to kill that Dorsey. The warboard is the biggest problem. Move up. Hit the Dorsey. And two further hits. <laughs> the guy is down. One more down. Nice. 
Okay, listen. Um... No way that was a hit. Fantastic. Cool. Plating. Get rid of the armor. Then removes up. It's very well. Marshall Quan. And finally Ramos. Decent loot so far. Got a level 17 assault rifle. Holy. That is really good. And I can tell you who's going to get that. Massive upgrade. Old rifle 8 to 10. New one 30 to 36. Okay. Good, if we want heavier armor, we will need to up strength, so two more rings and strings will do. Also gives us more hit points, and that's well needed. And we needed to get, oh, we need to get our block picking. Good, at the front, we're finally getting that extra hit points, and you can see it jumped to 200 hit points. So strength is worth it. You just need to hit the breakpoints for, uh, for the hit points. Good. This year the eagle will be great. Um, sure. Spirit animal sounds like a good idea. Animal companion drops to 25% con. Oh, look at that. That's not bad at all. So we gotta increase animal whisperer soon. Because crit chance is good. For now, let's improve that. Sneak attack damage plus 10%. Well, that's not bad. Uh, that is very good, actually. So we got a helmet that requires weird signs. Oh, that's why we are missing so often. Four strengths and weird signs. Well, this helmet here. fully cut it I don't like it okay we're going to figure out how to get her to four strings 
She's worth three already, so very soon she can wear that helmet. What a massive armor. So this is just one big piece of armor. I like his the other bonuses, healing bonus, crit resistance and resistance to poison. The helmet is fantastic. Just requires a very specific setup. Get more armor. Take the healing bonus instead, I think. Good, so how much armor do we have? 23. Oh, that's good. It's a good start. This thing here is 9 armor. Listen, it means we're missing a little bit more often. But it seems worth it. That helmet is awesome. Very good. Anything else over here? Great loot. We got randomly ambushed. Good. I'm not sure if this is the parking lot that uh, we were looking for. But that ambush uh, gave us some good loot. Well, let's see it, see the positive sides in it. What's this here? Hidden structure. Investigate the collapsed bunker. Alright, Hogbite begins to repair. Uh, we killed three of them, that's a good start. I would say that's a very good start. Central. Rallies everyone. Aqua tries to step out of the way and Lucia looks over here. Let's hit the legs. Good, that slows this guy down. Fantastic. Quan does the same over here. I'm 
and just kills him. That new assault rifle, very strong. All right, Murphy. One hit. That lost soul is a problem. Good, Lost Soul is not doing anything. Alright, enemies are moving in. And they are hitting for a lot. My little one disapproves that. I can understand it. Seems unfair at first, but we had our shots as well. But so far no one has been down. Well that in itself is good. Oh quite repairs. And, wait, 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 the Kodiak did not ride over this guy? Okay. Central. Hates that thing. Very much gets it almost down. Ramos. Does the same on his end. Quan rushes forward. Couple of shots. Murphy lays an ambush and I think we're good. Yeah, our Kodiak doesn't really care about any of that. Second time that we got ambushed just by trying to find that location.
All right, fantastic. So, Central. Hmm. Central could use some awareness as well, just to hit better. But coordination is definitely helpful for him. S speed also, because oftentimes it takes a while to get from A to B. But let's finish coordination first, and then we're just adding a few of the other things. Quan, on the other hand, just finished uh, coordination, so that's good. Um, yeah, mechanic upgrade, auto weapon upgrade, both fine. Auto weapon upgrade to eight uh, is helpful. First aid theoretically needs to be upgraded as well, but yeah. Currently can't really upgrade anything. Okay, apparently every single ambush you at least get a large crate with a little bit of stuff to compensate for your uh, for the damage that you've taken hmm where we can repair the Kodiak. Good. Hmm. I'm a bit lost. I mean, it says north of the bazaar. So for all I know, it could be here or anywhere else. And we're running into the third ambush. Are you kidding me? All right, light him up. Wow. And I thought Colorado trash was sad. You made a bad deal, Rangers. My father's using you for cannon fodder. Go back to Arizona before you take a bullet for him. The graves are cold up here. Okay. Get on your way home. Tell him to hire a better class of spy. That's some cold-blooded shit. All right, we'll deliver the message. Huh. Spoken like a true lap dog. Why don't you? Uh, why do you want to overthrow your father? Because he's taking too long to die of natural causes. And that's not either of my brothers. You think your father is killing Colorado? Are you blind? He's letting a crazy cowboy cult control our oil production. Our main trading hub is run by a bunch of idiots and monster masks. All that should have been state run ages ago. We. Ugh, why am I arguing policy with a bunch of gun jockeys? The point is, my father has Colorado in the palm of his hand. He's afraid to close his fist. I am not. You don't think your brothers are fit to rule? Ha! 
I can see you haven't met him. Vic's a depraved child, and Val's a brain without a spine. I wouldn't trust either one to run a mess tent, let alone a country. To think of all the years my father wasted grooming them for glory when I was right there. God. What else do uh, do we know about victory? Shoot him before he talks. Your sanity will thank you. And not that it'll be easy getting to him. He's got his followers hooked on some kind of hypno happy gas. They'll do anything for him, including die. And what about Valor? The sooner he dies, the better for Colorado. He's the perfect puppet for some usurper like the Gippers to put on my father's throne and claim he's the legitimate heir. Of course, killing him would piss Daddy off. And you ass kissers wouldn't want that. Might be the only way to get him out of Denver, though. Those Gippers got the hooks in him deep. Ha! Thank you for your permission, squad. Roll out. Well, she had combat robots, so didn't want to get overrun and acquire death number three. That very much looked like a staged encounter and one of those in the games where you could either die or take the friendly communication route. We took the quote-unquote friendly communication route. <sighs> Bizarre. We're not finding the collapsed uh, parking lots. Well, at least this is a good ex uh, an episode to explore. So you can see what Colorado really looks like. Good, we're escaping. I don't want to play yet another ambush. Hmm. Listen, there is maybe something down here. Maybe there is something that I missed. We're looking for an old parking uh, facility, so it can't be that difficult to find that, can it? Listen, I do have an idea. Maybe I was wrong the entire time. Maybe it is not on the world map. And maybe it is really where that uh, large frosty clown was. That's open. I am unbelievably stupid. There you are, red hats. Glad you could join us here. Opportunity awaits. You ready to take the bazaar with us? Not yet, give us right. a moment. Come back soon, Red Hats. Can we maybe overthrow these guys? Utility. Crit resistance. Oh, that's not bad. That's a good passive utility. Efficient plan. Kill them all. Step two, party. Well, 
and I assume you, it took you a while to find that rather elaborate plan. Good, look. Ready to take the bazaar? Now it's a question. What's the plan? It's brilliant in its simplicity. The monster army is weak, but rich. All we First we take the entrance. Then we go down and wipe out anyone. Uh, okay. So Sorry, I do have right. an idea. How about we tell Vlad about that? And he will give us money so that we're not doing it. Also, the monster army l uh, likes us so far, so where's the point in robbing them? We want to keep our relationships with them, not destroy them. I'm sure we can talk to uh, Vlad and warn him. And then Vlad will throw in some money and we just need to... Kill the douchebag. We should get something hot to drink for the trip home. We'll come back on our way out. You saved the bazaar. If you're in the wheelchair. The celebrated heroes of the bazaar. We've got some news you might be interested in. What would be worth for you to learn? Someone is planning to take uh, to make a hostile takeover. Money, of course. You know me as a generous man. Your loyalty. Charles knows, and his cartel are planning to oust you and take over the bazaar. Charles. Yes, I know of it. The tongue of a jester, but will not hesitate to kill for his boss. Oast here can only mean to kill us all. Mm-hmm. I thank you for showing this loyalty to the crown. Here is a small sum, but this is only a start. So Good, fantastic. We'll be waiting. Uh, stay away from that safe, lambs. Okay, fair enough. I thought I could just take something out of that safe. Apparently the answer is no. So we got some crit resistance. Who does not have a great trinket? Barter and perception? Yeah. You need crit resistance. Until I find out how to get cyber tech. Yeah, there should be a few more of these utility items. It feels like they are a little bit ch chai. A little bit too far and few in between. Good. Very good. So, now we all we need to do is take out that son of a gun and we should be good. Worked out just like I thought it would uh, once we were telling Flap or Flap or Flav about that whole plan to take over. It's nice that you can solve the quests in a kind of different format. Different endings and we're more the loyal uh, kind of uh, group. So eat this, eat that. 
Not sure if we're up for a hard fight. Do we have enough uh, cigarettes, theoretically speaking? Uh, it's going to be a little bit shorter. Oh no, we still got that. The big smoke for rough times. Light it up and we should be good. Shooting from here should be great. And that. And that. Quan is going to here. Ready to take the bazaar? Pleb knows about your plan. We're here to make sure uh, you never threaten this place so, again. Red hats. Shame and ask the gun. Oh yeah, get him. And we got uh, the drop on them. Fantastic. Rally everyone. Before nicely. Almost destroying all of them. Um, a little bit of a healing dart. Thank Can't you. Keep me down. Nice little hit. One almost got him down. Fantastic. Uh, which brings us to. Murphy. Are you kidding me? Thank you. Good, Murphy. As I was saying... Mark this guy. Get the other one nicely into in in their hat. down which brings us to kill Life goes for cheap. into switch weapon hell yeah very good Very good hits, okay. One, two, three, kill him, come on. Almost, but almost is not quite. Moving to cover. Oh. 
What a random thing. Taking the shot. And it's interesting, right? So, Central, for instance, got Insta Gimped here. These guys do have eight times as many hit points as we uh, do. So, just out of curiosity, does that? Get him back up. Good one hit. Two hits, that was a crit, a uh, good one. And another crit, cool. That was 200 points of damage, more 250. And he's still looking very, very healthy. That's a hit. Let's kill. And we don't even need to move. Fabulous hit. get his arms and he's crippled and down okay besides that kind of random just being taken down which feels a bit weird the rest was okay how many hit points does central have potentially also too little strength at this point since the bills are very focused in one direction Heavy machine gun, has the right sort of ammunition, I like that. So level 15, 10, 12, which means this here is the, the new gun. And that'll help us because we do have Moderate amounts of uh, 7.6 millimeter ammunition, and but the 50 cal, I think, was low again. Yeah, down to 47 energy cells. Not great either. So gotta be careful with that argon lance. Uh, rather stick uh, stick with uh, this here, the heavy machine gun. So we got 114 hit points, potentially not enough at, uh, at this point, mainly because strength is only at 2. So once coordination is up, strength, um, I will get strength and awareness up. Strength potentially all the way here to level 6, so that we do have that jump into hit point, uh, in hit points. Maybe I'll leave coordination at 8 for now and then go for strength 6 and a bit more aw awareness. Building a bit uh, more balanced character. But that uh, one shot kill is annoying. 
All right, to finish up uh, the episode, let's trade uh, that in and see what our reward for all of the hard work was. We certainly have prevented a very hostile takeover. And then I think we're going to wrap it up. Uh, Got to think about what we want to do the next time. We still have plenty of tasks to do. Maybe we are doing one more side quest and then starting to go for the first of the three childs. Ooh, we should get something hot to drink for the trip home. Welcome to the cold cat skin. Yeah, what else? Yeah. Kind of flu, right? Ooh, you look hurt. Always a pleasure to see the heroes illuminated with the correct thirty percent merchant discount. I hope. Thank you, Rangers. Here, a reward. The monster army has been around for a while. Nice. Okay. Ah, you again. What is it? Yeah. Very nice. Good. Cool. Um, we got quite a bit of a discount here, and with proper barter, that uh, the rest should work out very well. Certainly. Good. I think we're ending uh, the episode here. Got plenty of healing, uh, of healing items. Got enough uh, money. Let's just buy whatever ammunition is left over. And that'll be it. Guys, if you enjoyed what you've seen, leave a comment and a like down below. And as always, um, if you want to survive in frozen Colorado, you gotta smear some of uh, the anti-frost on the like button. That's why this is going to be a very, very long and cold winter. And you wouldn't like that, would you? So, uh, smear some on the like button and let me know if it had worked. Thanks a lot. Take care. Bye-bye.